The fact that we're in post Wano is actually wild. I didn't get to Wano of, for, like until about like three quarters of the way through this arc, but damn. I was still here for quite a bit, a bit of time, I can't lie, I've been here for like over a year, over a year, or, or almost close to two years possibly, sitting in Wano, so, it's been a wild ride, the fact that we in post, oh my god, that's crazy, we have, oh, um, there's so much more, we, oh, let's just go, let's just watch the episode, like, I can't, I can't even, like, think of all the things that are, that can still happen in Wano right now, in post-Wano, so I'm hype, I'm hype, let's go, they straight up go into when Luffy was falling, and he's gonna start losing his thing, yo, that is so crazy, I don't even know how his, his fucking clothes just unpaint itself, and Kaido's gonna fall to where Big Mom is too? Oh, he completely changed, I think he's just, just letting it happen, Honestly, I could see him just let it happen because this is what he wants. He's been suicidal the entire time. No way, right? That's straight lava dog. Because no, Luffy did die. He did die. And then all of a sudden, what a catch. <laughs> Bro is straight to sleep. Let's fucking go. Oh my God. I actually can't believe that. Silence. The lighting. Everybody's smiling, dude. Oh my god. And now Momo's sleeping as well. Everybody's resting up. <laughs> Yo, my boy is injured. He died like four times. The silence is crazy, too. It hits so much more with the silence. Wow. And then all the wishes. They've all been answered. All their wishes. Dude, this makes me smile so much, dog. Wow. That might make you cry, bro. Dog, this is like such a long-winded journey that like a conclusion is just so satisfying regardless of how unsatisfying it is or not. It's just so rewarding. Dog, and then it's time to party, yo! And this OST going hard! Yo! Everybody's finding out. Dude, this OST goes hard! They're alive! Let's fucking go! In retrospect, throughout all the, the, the fakes, uh, fake outs and everything, I am glad they're still alive. I am glad they're still alive. Look at them. They stood their ground through that entire thing. This is so hype, man. This is so goddamn hype. And then Law and Kid. Wow. What the f That is so insane. Oh, yeah. I guess he's he wanted to do it independently. He also got captured. It was kind of he got the short end of the stick of everything. Law is pretty happy because this was his end goal the entire time, allying with Luffy. So he's he's content with it. Dude, I hate this guy so much. I can't believe he's not dead. Yo, I'm ready to see what the world government thinks, yo. This is insane. <laughs> Oh, man. I don't know. I just get so happy and hype with One Piece, bro. This is amazing. Then Jinbei is officially a part of the crew. We still need that toast dog. Hey, and Sanji redeeming himself. And this OST. When you hear this OST, you know, you know everything's chill, man. You know everything's okay. What the fuck is Robin? <laughs> what the fuck? When did these people, these two become such good friends? Chopper has a shit ton of work to do. Crazy amount of work to do. This motherfucker just pops up whenever it's convenient for him. It's crazy. Same with this goddamn squirrel. They have not, not a clue of what just fucking happened. They don't realize that all their prayers were just answered. And I can't tell if this fucking child is just smiling because of the smile fruit or if she's actually happy. Oh, no. Now we're going to be hit by some sad shit after I said that. God damn it, bro. Okay, this is fucked up, man. <laughs> There's not a thought between those eyes. Man, this was such a goaded moment. And when we found out about the smile fruits... Man, fuck you. Actually so sad, dog. Luffy totally- What would- You would think Luffy would eat the fucking smile fruit? You know, if he was really hungry, he would totally eat that smile fruit and he'd probably be fucking dead. <laughs> this, this is- This is Luffy's one weakness. He gets hungry and then just eats another devil fruit for- Because he's fucking hungry. Messed up.
Okay, this is messed up. Is she crying while... Mm, dog is... What the fuck, man? And then the whole town was like that. It's supposed to give such, like, a happy vibe, but it... it... When you see, like, the... behind those smiles, it's so fucked up, man. It was, like, the same thing in Dress Rosa. I think it would have been better if I read that part. But, like, watching the anime, like, even though I understood how fucked up that was with the toys and everything, it's just, like... <sighs> Oda, man. You're... Wow. Wow. It's a bit dark, but it's also... This is cute. Man, double you dad, dog. What a dad. And then now she's genuinely smiling. Man. God, fuck. Uh, One Piece does it all the time. They do, it doesn't miss. It doesn't miss when it comes to the emotional moments, regardless of what character it's for. It's, it's ridiculous. What's up with Zunisha? I will not open the borders yet. Ah, oh. I mean, I feel like that's a fair assessment. And I feel like that's like the most mature decision that Momo could have ever made. It's actually insane. Dog, that's a new Momo, bro. Yo, are these guys really still trying to fight? What the fuck? I'm definitely not gonna give up, bro. They're so weird. What, what, what? Don't hold him back. Why are you holding him back? Kozuki Momo. Nah, Momo. They know Momo's strength. Or fucking Momo. Yamato's strength. Is Kaido still alive? No, he has to be still alive. Look at him. Look at his fucking outline just chilling over there. He's alive, dog. And if they don't show him, like, alive now, then he gotta come back later, bro. I doubt- I doubt the mag- the magma is gonna fucking kill him. And isn't the navy still there, too? What's going on with the navy? We don't know anything about everything around the island that's happening, too. Is there gonna be, like, a giant tsunami or some shit? A fucking- a- uh, underwater uh, uh, volcano volcanic explosion oh my god eruption damn bro start putting impact frames on the eruption too watch kaido just fly out of that fucking smoke what's going on though last time i checked volcanic eruptions don't be having lightning spewing out of them what's going on though what the fuck's going on with this cloud oh shit they don't even no that's momo it has to be momo it has to be momo it's momo dog Yo! Oh my god, dude! This guy's the ruler of Wano! Look at him! This is fucking fire! Nah, 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 nah. Come on, clarify, clarify. Dude, what a fucking entrance! Momo's just setting, like, setting the score! Is that, is that, is that Hiori? That's Hiori first, and then Momo's gonna come behind her? Yo, and they don't know that's Yuri. Oh my fuck. And they haven't seen them in ages. They thought they're dead. All these people, they think they're dead. Bro, that's not him. That's not him. Wow. Wow. The new Shogun of <laughs> Oh my god, dog. Next episode. Oh, now they're actually doing a recap. Okay. Now now we're back into the the basic structure of things. I bet they're all going to remember. They're going to see and they're going to be like, "Yo, what the fuck? I thought you were dead." Damn, look at him in his cloak. They remember. Oh my god. Nah, bro. They have no idea. This party is about to be the craziest thing ever. Dude, they all look so sick with their fucking cloaks, man. Yo, this is so hype. They just, like, skimmed over, <laughs> over Shinobu. Yes. Yes. Yo. Oh, my God. Dude, this is crazy hype. With the OST and everything, this is so wild. And they they probably think it's time to fight Kaido, but little do they know, Kaido is fucked up already. He's been packed up. Wow. And he's gonna see. Yo! That's hype. 
And then all the, the factories are being destroyed. I'm surprised they actually haven't met her yet. Or him. <laughs> his bro's just shining. <laughs> no, bro. What's 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 his reaction gonna be? Yo, wait, what? Wait, 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 what? No way. No shot. Wait, what? Wait, what? What? Dude, this guy. Zoro. Look at them, bro. He'll be fine. He'll be good. <laughs> Man, they can see how fond uh, he is. Oh, really? Aww, this is adorable. What the fuck? <laughs> That's kind of adorable, but she's like a fucking horse, so it's kind of weird. <laughs> like it's very off-putting that she's she's just a fucking horse with big ass breasts. Oh, now it's time! Oh, dog! Oh my god! Oh no, this is crazy. Holy shit. And Hiyori... Hiyori knows as well. Oh no, I don't even think she's seen him yet. I haven't seen him! Yo, we're all fucking... Yo! Oh my god! What the fuck? Oh, you can't get me hyped like that and then show the fucking eye catchers. God damn it, bro. <laughs> this is it. This is it. Nah, bro. They don't even know. Yo! Oh my god, Momo. And she hasn't seen him grown up. This is so insane. When she was so small. What the fuck? Did her father die in the factory? I feel so bad for Otama. She's just lost so many people. But she's still like, so like bubbly and everything. Man, at such a young age too, bro. Like I hated on Otama for like being a bitch to Luffy when, when he told her that Ace died. But like, can you even blame her? She's still a child and everything. Man, this just makes me feel so much... So bad for her. And then he came along. <laughs> oh, not with this OST, dog. What is this OST? Oh, man. Oh, man. Otama was, like, due for a backstory like this. Man, and then finally, finally, man, I'm going to cry. Finally, it happened. They're finally free, yo. It's, it's setting in for all of them. Finally, they've defeated them. Oh, we're going to see him now. Yo, yo, are finally defeated. Yo, yo. What alliance. And then the f oh my god, and they're playing what? The opening. The first opening, like, theme in a remix. Man, Carrot, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> I'm the biggest Carrotator. I got No, Pedro's the goat, though. No, Pedro's the goat. Turn into a fucking dragon. Yeah. Yeah, you bit Kaido. Oh my god! Look at this fucking dude! Oh shit! Oh my fucking god, dude! I'm so glad I was able to avoid spoilers for this shit! Oh my fuck! He's grown up, man. I'm in- I'm in just awe. I'm in fucking awe, bro. Everything. He's going to become the strongest, like, swordsman in, in all of Wano. Holy shit, look at this guy! Yeah! Yeah! 
I love this shit so much. The eight year old man. Oh, wow. Man, I just love One Piece. Like, it's just like, it's so long-winded. But then when you get to that moment and the end of an arc, it's just like, mm, it's so rewarding. And they, ah, oh, dude, it was, I love this fucking show so much. And for October, thank you to Lava Mob, Sandro, and Leon Akafabi for the tier two subs on Patreon. If you're trying to see these reactions early and uncut, as well as some exclusive content for only a single dollar, then be sure to check out the Patreon.